Warning, this article contains spoilers from The Gold The Gold continues this evening, March 12th, on BBC One at 9pm and is streaming on the BBC iPlayer. The show is a dramatic retelling of the 1983 Brinks Mad Robbery, the world's biggest heist which saw three tons of gold bullion stolen from a security depot. The BBC drama has combined fact and fiction to create a compelling story with many of the real-life characters involved in the crime appearing in the TV series including Brenda Noy, played by Nicola Burley, the wife of criminal Kenneth Noy, Jack Loden. Where is Kenneth Noy's wife now? In the TV series, Brenda and Kenneth were in a loving marriage with the housewife sent on a cooking course by her husband so she could whip up an Italian dish in the kitchen for him. But she was less impressed with her husband joining the Freemasons and felt like he was trying to prove himself when he didn't need to. In real life, Kenneth and Brenda met after he was seeking legal advice from a barrister while he was in a youth detention center. At the time, Brenda was working for the barrister as a legal secretary. They later married in 1970 and had two sons together. What happened to the other half of the Brinks Matt Gold? On November 26, 1983, three tons of solid gold bullion was taken by six armed robbers from the Brinks Matt Security Depot near Heathrow Airport. The criminals had been looking to do a run of mill heist when they stumbled across a much bigger prize of the gold which was worth £26 million. But what exactly happened to the other half of the Brinks Matt Gold? Clarkson said of Brenda's portrayal in the gold, I mean, she's depicted okay in the show. I met her, she's okay, he said if the show got a season 2, Brenda could get more screen time. The acclaimed writer and journalist said, in answer to the wife, so far she's got off lightly but it will be interesting to see if they handle noise interest in other ladies because there were a lot of them, some of them I've actually met. That would be interesting but I think that's for the future. Adding, I don't think there's much to say about her so far in the series. Clarkson went on say about what Brenda was doing now. They divorced. She went to live in Cornwall. However, Clarkson said she'd come back and is said to be living in Kent again. He went on to explain, she's around. Like all the women in his life, this is the interesting thing about Noi. They are either too afraid to hate him and loathe him, or he genuinely manages to get away with screwing them over. He continued, there's a harem of girls, some of them I've met but they all have a wry smile on their face when it comes to Kenny Noy. The BBC has yet to confirm whether there will be a second outing of the gold, but the story was certainly left open for more. Season 2 could see the continuing investigation to recoup the stolen gold and the money. Clarkson also shed some light on Kenneth, saying he was now speaking to journalists and becoming something of a celebrity. The writer said he thought Kenneth was also working on a book about his life. Don't miss. Prince Harry has put himself in danger and should miss coronation. Insight 4 in a bed owner fumes after guest refuses to stay at B&B. Video Kate Garraway calls out Prince Harry for inaccurate Lilibet detail. Latest, Clarkson said the show was good and he couldn't be as critical as he wanted to be. Some of the details which were different from real-life events including the inclusion of Detective Nikki Jennings, Charlotte Spencer, saying he wasn't aware of a female officer so close to the Brinks Matt investigation. He also said the class war between South London and the establishment, which runs through the series, was something of a cliché. Clarkson said. But then I realized it is good and I realized that most people who watch TV are in the 60s and this seems to appeal to them. 
but there's another market that finds it fascinating because of the era in which it's set and the attitudes and the differences and even the retro outfits. The Gold airs on BBC One on Sundays at 9pm and is streaming as a box set on the BBC iPlayer The Curse of Brinks Matt by Wensley Clarkson is available to buy now.